What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to episode 4.5 of the How to Make an FPS series in UE4. And in this episode, it's just a fix episode. If you guys haven't noticed before or seen some of my other series, the .5s or the half episodes are usually fixes or whatever, or something that don't I wouldn't dedicate an entire episode to in and of themselves uh, just because of their minor amount of content. So in this episode, we're going to be fixing two small problems. Problem number one, and this was just a small oversight on my part, um, is the shooting. So if you guys remember last time, the shooting will not um, stay to our to our gun, even though we did set up muzzle rotation. Um, and that's just a small oversight on my part that some of you might have caught. Um, and the second issue is the uh, snapping that you guys may notice, and not the best movement uh, issues, or the, the, some movement issues, and not the best visual movement um, option, or you know, option that I can uh, present. So let's fix the movement real quick, because that's a very simple movement. Let's open up our blueprint character. Click on BP player character and big thanks to uh, excuse me if I'm mispronouncing Satura um, for reminding me this. I always always forget this because this is one of those things that I don't do often enough because I don't make brand new characters or brand new projects often enough to remember this one dumb thing and it's <laughs> Uh, it's orient uh, orient rotation to character movement. Um, if I could spell, if I could go to the right area, <laughs> it's in character movement. I said BP player character orient rotation uh, to character movement, and it's it's currently uh, currently on, but we need to have that off, and that's gonna fix the smoothness. And uh, we'll see. You can see now that I'm turning left and right, there's not that jitter and stutter um, that we were experiencing before. And that's just my computer freezing. And then solution to problem number two is even easier. That should not be all the way over there. <laughs> that's weird. Solution number two is even easier um, to the shooting issue. So what we're going to do is right click and make a tick and on this tick, um, per the norm, we need to sequence this. We need to drag off first, uh, then zero, actually, and then type in set muzzle location, or rotation, excuse me, and uh, that should just fix that issue there. So I, I completely neglected to put it on the tick, and now if we go into full auto mode, it will properly follow where we are looking. So that definitely looks a lot better and, and operates just just in a slightly like slightly better way. Obviously, the, the gun's a lot better. That ain't slight. Um, but obviously, the visual aesthetic of the movement isn't, isn't as jarring anymore. So hopefully, uh, this fixed it for you. If you are still running into issues, please do not be afraid to leave a comment or join my Discord channel where... Uh, it's also pretty darn easy to contact me. My name is the Sarge Kyle on Discord, of course, just as it would be in YouTube, and I hope to hear from you guys or see some newcomers in there. But other than that, hopefully um, you guys have seen my latest video, Basic Blueprint Terminology, and uh, take a look at that if you haven't. Anyways, that'll be it for this episode. Uh, see you guys in the next one, and until next time, have fun.